Hello, welcome back to Pine City Hickory. Today, we've got an unboxing and a project. So, let me show you what's going on. All right, so this year we're gonna do Langstroth hives again. We're gonna try two. Let's go ahead and uh, get this opened up. Then we're gonna start doing some painting on it. All right, so let's go ahead and open her up. They always give you a poster so you know what's what. So. Right. This is the telescoping inner cover, or this is the telescoping outer cover. This is the uh, inner cover, notched. Now. I don't think I'm going to paint this. I've had issues when painting them that uh, they stick. This is the deep and it comes with 10 frames. This is the entrance reducer. So you can start off with a small opening. You can graduate them to a medium opening, then you can remove it. This is the screen bottom board. It's got screen for ventilation and it has the mite count checkerboard. This doesn't get painted, but this does. Alright, this is going to be the easiest thing to paint. So I'll start with it first. So here is the paint that I got at Ace Hardware for $10. It's a semi-gloss house and trim exterior paint. It is high hiding white. So yeah, I was worried that I didn't get in dark color, but you can't get much lighter than white. It's a premium, so that's always a good thing. The reason it was low is because there's damage here and it was leaking. So if they tried to shake this for the customer, they'd have a big mess. It would come flying out of there. All right, so let's get this open. So, I could not get them to shake it, that means I got to stir it, and uh, stirring is fun, so I'm going to go ahead and let you watch all the stirring action, no, maybe what I'll do instead is I'll stir, and then uh, once I think that it's all stirred up, I'll bring you back. How does that sound? You get the paint stirred up. Now, on this, what we're going to want to paint is just the sides and the bottom part here of these side rails. Uh, we don't need to do the interior at all, and we'll see how it goes. For sure, one coat, maybe two. We'll see how it covers. On this ingrain area, I always like to get a little more paint there because that is that's where moisture is going to wick through. So I like to get that sealed off as much as I can. 
Hey, wow, man. Are, are you painting, man? Hey there, hippie Paul. Yeah, I got this new bee box and I got to paint it. That's, that's far out. That's way cool, man. Hey, I saw your hair before, man. That look, that's a good look for you, man. You should, you should keep that look. Yeah, I like that. I like that look on you, man. I don't think so, Hippie Paul. I just took off my hat and I wasn't thinking, but thank you for the vote of confidence. Hey, this is the side we've been waiting for. This is the last side. We'll go ahead and get this one painted up and uh, we will let it dry and then we'll come back and take a look to see how the coverage is. If there's just a few, we'll just touch them up. But if there's several, then we'll just do a second coat. So, we're going to pause at this point, we're going to let this dry, um, I see the spot already when I get We will let it dry and then uh, we'll come back and take a look to see uh, how the coverage is. I didn't prime because it's a bee box. Hey man, when you paint... Do you have to like wait for it to dry man before you can do anything else? So we're back. Um, paint has had a time to dry and I'm just gonna look here real quick to see how it looks. A little thin right here so I might touch up that area and here. second coat and that's going to complete the coat for the top cover. Next up we're going to be doing the bottom board and uh, we'll do that after this dries. So we'll bring you back. Alright this is the screen bottom board. This is the bottom of the bottom board and this is the part that the bees will be on. So we're going to paint the bottom first. You can really tell they just slap these things together. There's no, uh, there's no pride in workmanship. All 
okay, man, have fun painting. I, I'd help you, man, but, but, <laughs> uh, uh, who am I kidding? I ain't gonna help you, man. <laughs> have fun. Ha, ha, ha.